And now, it is time to introduce the equipment and process of permission. It needs about 27 square meters to equip the equipment for automatic operation. If with a preparation room, it needs about 99 square meters. Permission process includes coffin separation, cryogenic freezing, vibration, freeze drying, metal separation, filling and burial. The coffin will be handled separately at the coffin separation stage and the corpse will be moved to cryogenic freezing process. In the process of cryogenic freezing, the liquid nitrogen at minus 196 degrees Celsius will be sprayed inside the machine and the body becomes crystalloid through this process. Crystallized body goes through the vibration process that disintegrates the body into particles within a few minutes. After this process, the crystallized body particles will be collected and moved to freeze drying process. The water remained inside the particles will be removed through sublimation process in vacuum condition and this process will be conducted inside the drying machine which is based on the principle of freeze drying. For example, a body that weighs 70 kilograms will leave 20 kilograms of particles that is only 30% of the original weight. This can be considered as the most ethical process, for it is, except the removal of the water from the body, there is no change of components of the body whatsoever. Then the dried particles will be moved to metal separation process, mercury, amalgam, sodium, metals and more than 50 other kinds of foreign substance can be removed in this process selectively. Then the remains will be put into a new degradable coffin that is made from corn or potato starch and sealed completely. The degradable coffin contains some composition which can be used to control the air, water and microorganism through the decomposition process of the remains. At last, the final remains and the coffin will be buried at the certain place according to the wish of the family members of the deceased, in depth about 30 to 50 centimeters. After the burial, it takes 6 to 18 months to turn into soil. At the same time, it will provide the nutrient to the plant. The final remains of permission not only is no harm to the environment, but also it can turn into soil within one year. Thus. It is indeed an ecological, eco-friendly burial method.